Hello, this is Callum here, and today we're reviewing the late October 2012 Mac Mini. Uh, this is the 2.5 GHz dual core i5, 500GB hard drive, and 4 gigs of RAM. And some may say that this is the slower version, to which it rightly is. But how slow does it run? Well, you'd be wrong to even think it ran, ran slowly. It's actually a pretty quick machine, and that's on 4 gigs of RAM. So when you bump it up to 16 gigs of RAM, well, what can I say? The truth is in the pudding, as they say. This is a fantastic bit of kit. Um, the way that the hardware uh, integrates with uh, OSS Mavericks, uh, which is a fantastic OS, much better than, uh, than Windows. I'm going to be honest, I'm about falling asleep there. Um, and it's all contained in a little aluminium case. Uh, you'll see a pictures, maybe a few bits of video coming up to the mountain. So what else can I say? The uh, the graphics work really well. I'm using a, uh, a TV here. Uh, let's go through HDMI. Um, and the only thing I would say is it does make the resolution slightly, uh, slightly smaller than it needs to be. Uh, but that is, of course, adjustable within the system preferences. And all the inbuilt software runs really well. All the new iLife and all the iWork uh, now comes absolutely free with it, which is fantastic. I'm an avid user of that. <clears throat> and also, Safari works really well. Because uh, if you get the Windows version, it can be a bit slow. The, uh, the only downside, I would say, is the fact that all the ports, so that's all your display ports, Sound your microphone or USB ports are on the back of the uh, of the unit, and also the power button is on the back flash side. Can be a bit of an issue if you uh, if you dithering bits of box. But all this can be covered by getting a USB uh, multi reader -y thing with like four ports inside. Uh, what else can I say? What else can I say? The new Mac Pro has come out, and of course this wouldn't have a whistle on it. But if you're a new Mac user like I was, I went over from, uh, from Windows, the Windows laptop, getting a bit slow for its time. I went up to the Mac Mini, and to tell you what, for the price, you pay about four nine nine for the i5, uh, and approaching six something, six hundred seventy thing uh, for the i7 version, which is course the dual core and that would run a bit faster than this but it depends what you use it for for an average user like me who does a lot of graphic work video work it runs very well and there's been no issues photoshop works well our movie works well um, and also watching hd videos on youtube just works flawlessly now the only thing i will say you don't have that much volume control when you put it into a tv because of course it goes through your tv's volume and also, if you plug in headphones into the back of it, that can be a pain. But apart from that, it's a fantastic product, and I would recommend it to anyone. And this is my now, this is now my daily driver for everything I do, from schoolwork to design work to websites to video editing, and also I do run a virtual machine every now and again. And the amount of programs I run, I have literally everything: new email, internet browser. Minecraft all at the same time, and there's no lag whatsoever. Whereas my laptop would be dead. If you're, if you're a Minecraft user, will know what it's like. It's fantastic. Everything runs well. You got to put it at a bit of a medium render distance just to keep it ticking over. Um, hopefully, I'll have some Minecraft videos uh, coming soon, maybe, maybe, and uh, hopefully some uh, some tutorials on Photoshop and what have you. Because this is now the king of the, of the palace, and I would say it's a fantastic recommend to anyone, fast as, as you like. The only downside is having the ports on the back, but you could, you could change them by turning the device around. No, that was the other thing. There's no disk drive. Who used disk drive anyway? You can always get it for a slightly cheaper price from Amazon. Get the super drive, or uh, Magic Mouse and the keyboard also don't come with it. So like, what, it's not an actual computer because it's only a box. Well, it is. But, uh, that's one of the great things about the Mac Mini, is it works with whatever equipment you've got. Whether it's a normal mouse, normal keyboard, any monitor, it will work flawlessly with it. So, I've also got an Apple keyboard coming in some time later this week. 
to start using with it. The only thing I will say is, because I use Windows literally all the time, the, uh, you literally have to learn two different keyboards, which is quite fun. But overall, the Mac Mini is a fantastic product, and I'd recommend for anyone to buy it. Um, I will have a link below. I went own into Lincoln to buy it, because there's a Apple reseller there. But you can buy it on Amazon or you can buy it from Apple. But I will have my version from the Apple Store in the link below. Now, thank you for watching. I've been Callum. Don't forget to check out lightscamscomputers.co.uk for your graphic design needs. Speak to you soon. Bye bye.